Paul a difficult night. What's your thoughts on that one? That wasn't good enough. Bottom line wasn't good enough. We, I think we were laboured with a lot of stuff. Second half was a bit better, but it, was, it wasn't good enough. And to be, to be honest, it's, it's not been good enough. The results have not been good enough for a long time. So, but <clears throat> as I said before, as a manager always gets the criticism of me, and I'm not going to stand here and be getting every bit of hitting that's coming, Jacob. You know, it, there's, there's others in it. We're all in it together. But obviously, the manager gets a the brunt of it, but the, the, the results have not been good enough. Given the sort of lethargic side that you've just mentioned, were you expecting a bit more of a response in the second half? Do you feel like you didn't quite get that? No, I got the second half, I thought it was, was all right. I thought that was not too bad. First half, it was too, too passive. To, they sat in and made it difficult and tried to have an encounter. And defensively, they were strong. But we, we tried. We, I thought we still had a penalty. We judged you. Never harmed. And, um, yeah, but as I said before, it's a results business. And the results have just not been good enough. But I'm not going to hide behind uh, everything. And, uh, we, we're, people can say we're four points for the playoffs or whatever it is, and we're a couple of games in hand. But right now, that's, that's no, um, uh, it's no good to look at them at. It's obviously a major part of football scoring goals. And yeah. Was that a concern tonight that we didn't test their keeper enough? Yeah, it was, I think it was only one was Norris, I think, wasn't it? Yeah. The second half. Yeah. And first half, said to his job, no, no the shot at the goal. And um, it's just, it's just whether it's a confidence thing or, or lack of confidence that they, they, they're not taking the the shot, Norris had the chance, to, maybe he'd done well when he came on, I thought. Um, but at the end of the night, Jacob, it just wasn't good enough. Just going to ask you about the, the penalty incident as well. You've just alluded to it. Yeah. You thought it was a penalty. Just talk us through that one on your on your point of view. The judges one. The judges one, sorry, when he was brought down, yeah. Well, well the, the first one, judges said that for the free kick, if you remember that one, that he jumped up with his arm and then it obviously hits his arm. Uh, and then the second one, to me, it's a trailing leg. I mean, he's cut inside and it's a trailing leg. But I was, listen, he has to call it the way he sees it, the referee, I think it, it looked like a penalty for where I was standing, but I think it's the, it was the aftermath of what went what after that, you know, I mean, you're telling me that it looks as if the referee went in, so I'd have to look at that. Yeah, that's something to look at, we can't confirm anything now, of course. Mm. Um, it looks like Flynn's first booking came from that incident for potentially booking, um, pushing the referee back. So just talk us through what Flynn's sort of been feeling because obviously a difficult night for him. Flynn was excellent as well, you know, and an incredible commitment. And that's what you get with him, you know, and, he, and he, uh, the frustration of probably what's been happening, I think, is, is boiled over. But he's a young guy, he'll learn from it. And... Um, but what you do get with Flynn is an incredible endeavour and I think he's going to be a top player in, in the years to come. Is that part of that drive what could take him far in the game, yep. but, he, but he needs to channel it in the right way? Yeah, 100%. He keeps uh, the red mist away at yeah. times and uh, he'll be totally fine, but he's got the, he's, I think he's got the, the devilment and temperament to, to be a real top player and if he can carry on, then hopefully he's going to have a really good career. Another home tie on Saturday, Paul, mm -hmm. and... Really, it just needs to be better, doesn't it? Need to step up. 100%. There's no getting away from it um, either. It's 100%. You, you, you have to do better. We, the Oxford are, are doing well. You have to do better. It'll be a different type of game. But we know ourselves that the lads know ourselves that they have to do better.